Peace. This is your Gullah Teacher teacher's son, Michaud, and today we're talking about acorns. Not acorns, acorns. And the fact that many of you probably initially heard me say acorn gets to the heart of what an acorn is. An acorn is a word or phrase that comes into existence as a result of mishearing a different word or phrase. What's fascinating is despite the misunderstanding, the acorns often take on the same or similar meaning as the words or phrases that they misunderstood. Acorns are not a uniquely Gullah phenomenon. In fact, there are very many in English that many of you would be surprised to know that you're not actually saying what you think you are. Still, there were many times growing up when my Gullah Geechee accent did create an acorn as a result of the way that I heard the word that was said. I would hear common English words and phrases and translate them in my mind to the way that we would say them in Gullah. For example, if mama said, go fall up your clothes and put them in the chest of drawer. What I heard, chest of drawer, like Chester. What was actually being said was chest of drawers. Who knew? It wasn't until I could learn to read and actually read a can that I realized that pork and beans was actually pork and beans. Daddy always used the exclamation around the house, corn found the luck. And I always wondered, what does he mean by corn found the luck? But alas, he was saying confounded luck. All right then, now keep going, it could be kitty by the door. What I thought was kitty by the door was actually Katie bar the door. Two completely different sentences, but both meaning Whenever I had to get it, somebody say, boy, you got your rabbit mind. I just knew they were referring to a bunny rabbit. Nope, rabbit. I really get a kick out of acorns because they make so much room for happy accidents to happen in language and new words, phrases to begin. And that's just how language lives and breathes. That's it for today. Remember, mask up, stay safe. Till next time, we out you.